Hey guys, Tyler here for bleepingjeep.com. Working on Project Tetanus this week. This is the rear end. I'm uh, doing a, a disc brake conversion on this rear Dana 44. So as I was pulling the, the drum brake apart, immediately noticed all this grease and crud inside the, uh, the brake drum. This is, this is really bad news. Uh, that crap gets on your, your brake pads and pretty soon you don't have brakes. Um, basically what that means is that I've got a bad seal on the axle and it's allowing the gear oil to leak out. That's working its way up into the brake. I definitely want to fix this problem now while I've got this apart. To do that I'm gonna have to pull this axle shaft so I just wanted to show you guys a, a quick tip today. Um, they make a tool called a slide hammer that attaches to this and uh, Matt's got a video on how to use the slide hammer but if you're like me and you don't have a slide hammer or you're let's say you're out on the trail and nobody in the group's got one because it's not a tool you normally take this is just a real quick simple way to, to get an axle shaft out using uh, just a chain a tow chain so let me show you how to do that now ju just as a heads up guys this is for non c-clip style axles only a C-clip style rear axle like the Dana 35, you're going to have to pull the diff cover, reach in there, there's a pin you take out of the of the differential that allows you to then push this axle in, it drops a C-clip out, and then this just slides out. This style of axle uh, will not do that. So let me show you how this works. Just take a sh your toe chain. and attach it to one of the wheel studs with a lug nut and just crank it down, finger tight's fine and then you just use this chain like a whip just like that um, normally it's not that easy Normally you have to whack on it two or three times, but you guys get the idea. This is a real good, you know, on the trail kind of uh, kind of way to, to get your axle out. If you break an axle on the trail or whatever. So, anyways, that's the tip for today. Uh, I'll be coming back to you next week with another video. Hopefully we're going to be installing the disc brakes on this. Uh, I've got some, some stuff in the works right now. And... Uh, We'll have another video from Project Tetanus. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and go visit bleepingjeep.com for uh, t-shirts, parts, and all the best how-to off-road videos on the internet. Thanks for watching.